Outside a cedar inn, along the road to Ebonheart, sits a swampy little abode, the Draggletail Shack, an atmospheric little dwelling covered in coat of flowers, built atop the swamp with those telltale blue draggle tails just growing all round, and early blinking lights of countless glowbugs just dancing across the evening skies. A rustic setting with a view of the sea and the cities of Vec and Ebonheart, this beautiful, breathtaking shack is a yet another mod by Katya Carell. For today's while the day is none other than Draggletail Shack, a one of a kind player home with a quest. Outside of this scenic abode, uh, you'll find the previous owner, apparently just planning to travel and are ready to sell this unique little home for the low, low price of 1500 gold. A, a suspiciously low amount for such a gorgeous location. Should you agree to his price, uh, this home is yours for the taking. And it is an utterly charming property, with an outdoor deck that wraps around back, uh, leading to a small, uh, poorly maintained, uh, dock looking out towards Ebonheart and Vivek with the remains of a nearby shipwreck just, uh, you know, adding that little extra oomph to the atmosphere. Uh, also out back, uh, you'll find a few places to sit and admire the view, an outdoor table to use as a workbench, and above it all is a lovely covered balcony, with a hammock where you can rest with a view of the beautiful outdoors, a little dining nook, and just lots of lovely potted flowers. Combined with Grotmar and Swamp Trees, and uh, the atmospheric blue glow of the regional glow bungs, uh, this is a truly magical location. The perfect swampy abode. Ideal for a rustic hermit, a hedge wizard, a would-be fisherman, or perhaps an alchemist. Heading inside, uh, you'll find just an equally lavish, detailed, and atmospheric abode. Every bit as dripping and rustic charm as the exterior with plenty of storage for you to use, a lovely hanging potted plants, a central fire pit for cooking, and a little lounge where you can rest and relax. And there's a riding nook and shelves to store just uh, whatever items that you might have. And uh, while this is just a very clearly not a large player home, it is still just absolutely gorgeous. But uh, going upstairs, uh, you'll find the cause of the previous owner's sudden departure. For apparently a dreaded banshee licks in the shadows, a fiend that you'll have to defeat before properly claiming uh, this abode as your own. But uh, once you do, uh, this mesmerizingly atmospheric and captivating home by the sea is all yours to enjoy. Another just fantastic player home by the extremely talented Katya Carell. Uh, this was another mod made for the 2023 Summer Mod Jam. In fact, it is the only player home submitted for that event, built over the course of a single weekend. An impressive feat for such a lush and detailed location. I, I definitely recommend it if you're looking for just a charming new abode. But uh, that's, uh, that's pretty much all there is to see here, so uh, that's just our more of the day. As always, uh, I've been your host for Golf Guy, uh, thanks for watching, stay safe, stay healthy, happy modding, and I'll just, I'll uh, see you all next time.